Mother of a pregnant missing woman is once again pleading for the public's health. The family has been told that Misha Johnson is likely dead, so finding her body is now a priority. Nikki Schoenfeld follows up. The mother of Misha Johnson says it's been nearly two months since she last saw her. She says on July 11th, she was in Kapolei with her daughter and son-in-law, 28-year-old Dwayne Johnson. She spoke to her on the phone the next day. That's also when Misha reportedly told Dwayne's mother about his infidelity. From that point on, the only communication from Misha was via text. The tone and things changed from the 12th. In late August, Dwayne Johnson was charged by the U.S. Army Council for providing false statements, obstruction of justice, and the production and distribution of child pornography related to her disappearance. I truly believe somebody knows something either about Misha or about Dwayne. She is frustrated with the lack of information regarding the case, but she hopes private searches, leads, and tips can help lead to her daughter's body. At least I can do one thing in my life that would be to bury my daughter and give her a proper burial. And show her how much I care and love her as a mom. And I can tell her I'm sorry. I am so sorry. <laughs> I couldn't protect you. <laughs> One lead is here. I'm about two and a half miles from Schofield Barracks off of Kamehameha Highway, just south of Dole Plantation if you're heading towards the North Shore. Several reports came in saying that there was a red Mustang that was parked in this area for a few hours in mid-July. And that's important because that's the exact same car that Dwayne Johnson drives. They're looking for any footage between July 14th and 19th. There's no indication of what he did from the 14th through the 19th along those timelines. So if the car was there, he may have disposed the body there or did something there. She says the car is a 2019 red Mustang that had a Hawaii National Park license plate. Come out, come out, please. Come out, please. I mean, do it anonymously, give as much details as you can, call the number, because I understand that, oh, it's not my business, but it is our business as a community. We have to keep Hawaii safe for not only ourselves, but for those around us. There is a $10,000 reward for any information regarding Misha's disappearance. Nikki Schoenfeld, KH12 News, working for Hawaii.